is up guys legend crazy back with the fourth installment of the hogwarts legacy series as you can see we're on the we're rocking that new fit uh today i uh, told my friend he reminds me a little bit of cal kestis with the fit minus minus the scarf but uh no it's definitely a pretty pretty far fit i'm not gonna lie we're not rocking a robe but uh you know we're all looking pretty good and uh we are jumping my buddy my friend Mac and I hopefully his mic does work but uh you know if it does it does if you can't hear him you can't hear him I guess but I'm gonna be talking to him so alrighty I got an objective to do now there's something in there like it's oh chest can I get that real quick no I cannot okay Mm -mm -mm. Alright, so where am I going right now? Oh, so am I going to the greenhouse? Is that where I'm going to right now? Yeah, herbolo yeah herbology. Yeah, herbology class is where I'm going right now. Yeah, so. Max a bit farther ahead of me in the game, but. He does have a, a crush on the teacher in herbology class. Oh, I gotta begin quest. There we go. Okay, yep. Yep, I can uh, I can see it. Yeah. See Good morning, Professor Garlic. How wonderful it is to see you again, Lenora dear. Oh, here. Yeah, she bad. These for today's class. Uh, mm -hmm. Um uh, a little treat for your auntie. Oh, look, look at my guy. Hello. My dude looks so freaking just Class. Raise him up, raise her up, bro. <laughs> We why is why is Sebastian together. just like pissed off? He's just staring at me like you like a bitch, How bro. thrilling it is to have everyone back together again. I want some merch. This year no will cap. be filled with enchantment and excitement, but the most important thing cultivated in herbology is knowledge. I the don't like that. Knowledge. No of the What's the most important thing in herbology class? Knowledge. Yo, what have I got in my hand? What is that? Now then. It's like a snowball Today, or something. Ourselves with the no, not the mandrake road. God damn it, bro. It's ugly motherfucker, bro. Let's see if we can't make our fibrous friends a bit more comfortable, shall we? <laughs> First, let's protect our ears. Oh, they're the mitts, that's what they are. Now, everyone. Grip their mandrake by the tendrils and give it a firm tug. Oh my god, what an ugly Oh my, it's literally breaking the windows. What the hell? Ugly ass man, Drake boy. The soil should envelop the root like a warm, dirty blanket, putting the mandrake right at ease. Can we just put on a blanket that? That's like the case. Repair. Oh, she prepared the glass. Okay. I'm very sorry about that. Yours was a bit mature, I'm afraid. All right then, off you go. Splendid work, everyone! That was a pretty quick class. They spent like two minutes in class, but whatever. Now for our next task, we'll be planting ditty oh, at okay, our cotton no, hmm. I wonder if hippogriffs like not grass. Hey, what's up, Natty? She can walk past me? Okay, whatever. It's tradition in my family to play a game of Quidditch on the moors during the holidays. Never a dull moment when I get I gotta talk to the professor. Yes, professor. Firstly, well done with your mandrake. They can be rather difficult to get a grasp of. I nearly went deaf. I'll say. Nearly went deaf. Well, yes. Of course, the cry of a mature mandragora can be fatal. So remember to keep those ears protected. Hey, we now, said like 20 mandrakes at the same time, but whatever. Dittany. Let us find you some seeds. I already have some, Professor. Picked them up in Hogsmeade. You visited the Magic Neep. Wonderful. A prepared student is bound to bloom. I've arranged for you to Ooh, have your own She says I'm bound to bloom, bro. It wasn't <laughs> easy to spare one on such late no, notice. I'm saying. Plant the seeds there now, and you can return to harvest them later. 
Even with soil, sunlight, Isn't that and like a bit magic, of magic, I can use it will take time sunlight. to grow. Let's see how to balance my staff this way. I just burn all the plants. Yeah. Yeah. Or roses. This needs restorative Small properties. Small plants. Make it a so I gotta do what? In the oh, potion. the Dittany. As you all know from Professor I ain't waiting ten minutes, per. Well, Done. Once Not it can be harvested, your destiny will be ready to use in Wigan Web oh, Potion. Oh, Wigan Web Potion. I'll yeah, let yeah, Professor yeah. Sharp tell you about that. Now, what say we branch out? Introduce you to a different sort of flora. The Chinese chomping cabbage. You'll find that some... The cabbages do get testy without... Yes, Professor. Come back and see me when you're... I gotta go meet Leander Hello. Pruitt. Hello. Saw you on your way to Hogsmeade the other day. Nice to meet you. I'm Leander. I'll be showing you the Chinese chomping cabbages. Up these stairs will take us there. But, your lead. Why, why the frick would I follow you, man? Or why would you follow me? Nice I don't know the hell defense against the dark arts, by the way. Excuse Thanks. me? Your duel with Sebastian. And he's good. <laughs> Thinks he's really good. But you outright slaughtered him. Here we are. Hope. Damn, he's spinning facts, bro. Now, I did outright dummy. slaughter Sebastian. Just toss the cabbages at it, and they'll do the rest. What do I have at L1? What's this for? L1. Oh, here we go. L1 to get the chomping cabbage. I got what? Throw it at this dude? That's not what I meant to do. Oh, oh, what the? Fuck? Anything they can get their Yo! That is sick. Last year to keep the gnomes out. Did save her the denoming, but they left her honking daffodils in tatters. Vicious little sick. bastards, aren't they? My kind of plants. Not like stupid booba tubers and bouncing bulbs. The kind of plants that just have your back in a fight. That's pretty cool. I'm not saying you can't go it alone, but well, imagine that wasn't a dummy. I suppose they could prove useful outside of the greenhouse. Nothing wrong with a bit of backup. Even if it is from a cabbage. It's chaos out there. Trolls in Hogsmeade and such. You can't be above throwing a cruciferous vegetable if necessary. Dogweed and death cap. You get the idea. Take your time. I'll see you back in class. With that helpful reminder as to why we should always wear our dragon hide glove. I tended to the Chinese chomp. Magical plants have so much to offer. I'm eager to learn more. I'm glad. Herbology is a bounteous subject. Tend to your garden, and it will tend to you. Huh. Well, I suppose that's everything. Do come by for a chat sometime. I so enjoy chat. Those mandrakes are really relishing their new pots. Only cost me my damned hearing. Incendio! We must first understand. Uh, I think I gotta meet Natty now. I think that's my next objective. Uh, know that. Next objective, Natty, right? Nope, potions class. Okay, so I don't. Regarding the school after the incident in Hogsmeade, Professor Black would never allow potions class. There's more than he's letting on about the quarter. Potions is one of the most challenging and hazardous subjects taught at this school. As fifth years, you will be required to reach new heights of both discipline and intellect. Professor Sharp. You will begin this term by brewing a Wigan Weld potion. Mr. Takar, can you tell us why this particular potion 
might come in handy. Yes, Professor Sharp. The Wiganweld potion can be used to sterilize and even heal a variety of injuries. It can heal some injuries, but not all. Points for Ravenclaw. Before today's class is completed, each of you will have brewed a Wiganweld potion of your own. I'm about to brew like 20 of them, dog. Don't, don't even it. fret about it. Please begin. Don't even fret about it, my man. I'm about to brew 20 of them. We chillin'. Use a strong, even motion when crushing your ingredients. Please yep, be meticulous when adding powder to your potions. One errant sneeze could be disastrous. We ain't seriously gonna uh, just stirring it. I see most of you have not forgotten how to stir. Hey, what it do? Not an easy potion to brew. Yeah, but I made well it done. easy, bud. And from what I hear of your recent like. exploits in Hogsmeade, you'd also do well to practice brewing the defensive Edurus potion. Professor Weasley had you acquire the recipe from Jay Pippins, correct? Yes, sir. Good. For the moment, you can find the ingredients you need in my office. But in the future, you'll be expected to provide your own ingredients. Some can be harvested from the plants you grow in your herbology class, and rarer ones can be purchased. Others, however, may be harder to obtain, and will require you to be a bit more... resourceful. Come and see me when you've finished brewing, and we'll see if it was skill or luck the first time around. All these freaking My NPCs, they're like talking and then they look just like the disappointed. The rebellion. They just like Did disappointed. I hear Professor Sharp say that you have permission to go into his office? Yes, but know. why does that matter to you? Brilliant! And it matters because you can be a part of something truly creative. I'm Gareth, by the way. Gareth Weasley. Bit of Gareth a Weasley. With potions, if I do say so myself. Pleasure to meet you. Hey, Wait, would you look at that. Are you related to Professor Weasley? She's my aunt. Keeps too close an eye on me for comfort. Ugh. But she can't be everywhere. Listen, anyone with a troll-sized brain can brew an Adurus potion. I'm working on something that's certain to be spectacular. I'm just missing one tiny last ingredient that will add that extra spark. I suspect that's where I come in. You're as clever as I'd hoped. I simply need a single foop of feather, as you'll already be in Sharp's office with his permission. Perhaps you could grab it for me. Sure, why not? The Fwooper Feather. As long as you're certain Sharp won't miss it. I assure you he won't. Fwooper Feathers aren't that valuable. Uh, I'm, get, I'm getting a Fwooper Feather from this feather. Uh, Gareth Weasley dude. From Sharp's office. Your potion should not be that no. I'm just collecting everything it looks like. What well, am I mean, yeah, Sharp's not gonna miss it, right? Got some fooper feathers, man. You know, we. Oh, a chest. Here we go. 47 coins. Don't mind if I do. Don't, I'm just gonna it's let a little bit of a fire in here, you know? We'd be chilling. A well prepared Witcher Wizard always has a few potions. Here's the, uh, here's the fooper feather, man. I don't really care what potion you're brewing, just stay away from me. Potions are two things that can't uh, be rushed. Uh, eat and be thorough. Oh, yeah. We got the, uh, the Felix, uh, Felicia's potion recipe. And now we add the Mallow Sweet, and that's odd. What's happening? Uh-oh, Gareth, what'd you do? It's not supposed to. Ah! You bozo. Dragon Dog, what happened? <laughs> well done, Gareth. Incendio. Mr. Weasley. Sorry, Professor. Again.
Mr. Weasley did not do this on his own. His accomplice will answer to me as well. Oh shit, sharp spat, that's not cool. I brewed an Adurus potion as you asked, Professor. I'm surprised you had the time. You seemed rather busy helping Mr. Weasley brew chaos. Oh, I'm not means... sure what you're talking about, Professor. You will not earn favor with me by failing to take responsibility for your actions. I suggest you heed my warning. Well, I don't know what you're and talking about. for the about. work you did today at your own cauldron, I will say you've done well. I confess I was skeptical given the advanced nature of this class and the fact you're a new student. I'm glad I was able to meet your expectations. A rare occurrence. And you do well to remember that you're not a potions master quite yet. In addition to having a solid grasp of how to combine various ingredients, you should gain an understanding of the ingredients themselves. Pay particular attention in herbology. The plants you nurture there are often essential to the... Now, I recommend that you find a safe location in which to practice brewing. You cannot leave... No, are they, are they misspelling practice That'll be all. in this game? They're saying P R A C T I S E. It's like a each different of way to spell it. Excitement for one day. Oh, Class okay. Is dismissed. You know me, I'm a, I'm a American. You know, it's a P R A T I C E. You know what I'm saying? What kind of next objective? Is it in Hogsmeade? Where is it? What the hell is it? What? Yeah, yeah. So, oh, A level seven. Let's go. I can equip the hat I unlocked. Headwear. Boom, look at that. Boom. I would not have that appearance. Chill with that. That is ugly. The rest of town. That what was are you it? up to now? Can I go? So where is our next objective? It doesn't have it on the map. What the heck, man? Where is... Right, I'm just gonna keep running this direction, I guess, then, you know? Hopefully find it. If only a new student were to help me with my stuff. Damn, that objective is far away. How do I get out of here? How does one escape Hogwarts? Yep, here we go. Run, Forest, run. Dude, where am I even running to? Oh, what the? Hey, yo. Bro, I just got gobbled up by a frog. What the fuck? Alrighty then. Now, where's this room, though? What? The yellow objective mark. I literally just... I'm gonna uh, just exit if I can. Travel. We're gonna travel out of the school real quick. I don't know where this objective mission is. Okay, what's my like? Can I see what my objective is? I'll post quest one assignment. Here we go. The girl from the Yuga do. Yeah. Okay. Cool. I 
I've always said that travel broadens the mind. The legendary bridge. What the heck are these? Can I snag these? Hey, you got some leaping mushrooms or whatnot. Cubains, 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 cubains. Where, where is Natty, bro? Gotta collect me that moonstone. I wonder if they have like those uh rocks or whatever where Malfoy got absolutely decked by Hermione in what was that Prisoner of Azkaban? Yeah. It's like a wannabe Hagrid's hut down here. Rest in peace, um, Hagrid. This could prove dangerous if I'm not careful. This could prove dangerous if I'm not careful. Boy, be quiet. We got plot armor. Don't even, don't even fret, man. Don't even fret. Don't even fret, my man. It is good to see you, my friend. What's uh, Hello, what's crack like How are you? I hope you've recovered from our rather eventful trip to Hogsmeade. I am well, but I have been worried about you, my friend. With Ranrock and Rookwood and Harlow after you? Oh, right. Harlow. We did not speak about it at the time, but I am hoping now you might tell me why they were looking for you. Uh, uh I was told we keep a secret. I've never met Rookwood or Harlow. Perhaps they mistook me for another student. Hmm. A bit odd. The two of them pursuing a Hogwarts student so intently. But whatever the reason, you were clearly in danger. For now, it is safe to say that Rookwood and Harlow are a threat to both of us. To all of us. Which is why I wanted to speak to you. I realized something that day in Hogsmeade. You displayed such courage fighting that troll. And Serona wasn't intimidated one bit by Rookwood and Harlow. Both of you have inspired me to take a stand of my own. What sort of stand? Men like Rookwood and Harlow are the reason my mother and I left Matibili land. I am not going to sit by and watch them destroy my new home. Yes, Nelly, go, go, uh, fight Rookwood them and Harlow by are yourself. A dangerous pair, and the fact that they're working with Ranrock, well, all the more reason they must be stopped. Rumor has it that Theophilus Harlow runs Rookwood's day-to-day -day operations. Taking him down would cripple Rookwood's entire enterprise. That may be true, but shouldn't Officer Singer handle someone like Harlow? I spoke There's with a her. dragon fight she on was my polite, screen. but mm -hmm. perhaps understandably would not discuss details with a student. I overheard some of I was thinking that... All right. I am going but... to watch and listen and find... In the meantime, remember... Thank you, Natty. Be on your guard. Where do I go now? I beg your pardon! How dare you threaten me! What's going on here? There's no way I heard it all the way from over there, bro. Alright, well, I guess we gotta run it. Help the stranger. Indeed I will. Are these poachers or something? They must have come this way! Think! I've no idea who it is nah, you think I might have seen. I've been busy with my research. Nor Treadwell. I do not have time to. Victor Rookwood, don't give a dog shit nip back your time. 
Hey, y'all better. Speak of the devil. Mr. Rookwood would like a word with you. A student, you can't be sick. <laughs> Enough out of you. Leave her alone. Stupid. <laughs> Oh my lord, I just smacked him to the ground three times. Give him that kablamma kablam. Oh, that's Rockwood. That's not. That's like some Arkham Batman type stuff. You didn't kill him, bruh. Oh shit. Help him find me himself. Little brat. Ho ho, hit him with that wombo combo. Oh, I didn't complete the battle in time. That's a kind of unfortunate. I've never been accosted in such a manner. Then so close to Hogwarts. Are you all right? I am, thanks in no small part to your excellent defensive skills. Care to tell me why two Ashwinders were ready to dispatch me to get to you? No, I'm not telling you. Victor Rookwood's thieves and extortionists, his little cronies. They seemed quite keen on you. I'm not it's telling a long you, story, squat woman. Thank you for your help. Hmm. Well, you've avoided them for the moment. Priya warned me things were getting dangerous. Best get moving on my research before they return. You're a researcher? Nora Treadwell at your service. Bro, I could have guessed she was a researcher. Stop tripping. She's literally wearing, Merlin's like, the standard researcher life. outfit. I thought that Merlin and the tales about King Arthur's court were a myth. Mere myth? <laughs> You're lucky, sir. Chatters on endlessly. Merlin attended Hogwarts, you know, oh, and I'm really? studying some all? curious fixtures he left here centuries ago. Fixtures? These vine-covered pillars, dozens of them all around the area. I've taken to calling them the Trials of Merlin. I believe he created them as a diversion for his fellow Slytherins. <laughs> he was terribly fond Merlin of puzzles Merlin was a Slytherin? That's kind of crazy. I can see why you're so interested in Merlin. Well then, I'll... no one has yet managed to figure out how they work. But I believe I have just unlocked a crucial clue. I suspect that Mallow Sweet is an important component in getting the trials to work. Wow, Mallow Sweet. That Mallow Sweet. Something Versatile I can her. totally get. Merlin repeatedly mentioned it in his writings. I had just arrived to test my theory when I was... You see, each swirl in Merlin's writing has its symbol in the center. That started me thinking, what if... The Mallow Suite is meant to be placed at the center of the symbols. Precisely. Would you care to do the honors? We can see what comes of our little hypothesis. Sure, I brought yeah, a trunk me... chock full of Mallow Suite with me. It's just over there by my tent. This trunk? Yes, take plenty, even if you already have some. I'm taking them all. I have the Mallow Suite. Lovely. I'm taking now, it all. Notice They're the all lines mine. on the ground, as well as a stone swell on the ground. Each trial has these features. <sighs> Place the Mallow Suite on the swell, and we'll see what happens. My word! Did you see that? The vines disappeared. What should I do now? Hmm, this is uncharted territory. I am curious Protego. about these pyres. Incendio! Solve Merlin's trial. Oh, I know how to do this. I got this. Merlin's beard! The flames make the pyre sink.
What a day. I can hardly believe it. I take it we can call that a success? We can indeed. However, I now have even more questions. How does it work? I must review my notes. I may have missed something. Are all of the trials like this one? Hmm? Oh, not precisely. Well, I think each has those telltale vines and the swirl on the ground. You should feel free to solve them as you come. My guess is that uh, each will also re which you can find in Hogsmeade, should you need more. Things I there. really must Second. be off. Such a pleasure to meet you. Cool beans, and pleasure do be to careful out here. Incendio. <laughs> needed, I should Incendio. return to the safety of Incendio. my home. Accio. Leviosa. in our common room wants to talk to you. It's Eldritch Diggory. He used to be the Minister for Magic, I think. Eldritch Diggory? Oh, it's like, it's like a Cedric. Right a storybook. How nice to see you, my young friend. Do you want to go in the Forbidden Forest so damn bad, bro? This looks intriguing. Looks intriguing. Oh, what is this? Let's go inside. Cook chicken. Ah, oh, you can't even hurt chickens, bro. Like, what is this? Oh my god! Oh, my, I thought I thought I thought I should murk the sheep, bro. What was that? That was a pretty big shadow. Never be like. Incendio. Dun 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 dun. Revelio. Dude, I need that freaking Aloe Morris spell. This is crazy. Oh, I need head this way. Off on another adventure, are we? Incendio. Crazy with these field guides, holy. Incendio. 
Alrighty then. Just Okay. What are you up to now? Relax. I'm not even here to mess with you. Rebellion. You painting. wanted to see me, sir. Indeed. Allow me to introduce myself. So few students know who I am these days. Heldridge Diggory, former minister for magic and founder of the Aura Recruitment Program at your service. I believe you can help solve a decades old murder thanks to that book you found and, in particular, its missing pages. How do you know about the book and the pages? We portraits here more than you might suspect and most of us can keep a secret. So, what say you? Surely a Hufflepuff such as yourself will be inclined to help seek long overdue justice. This could be right up my street. Even we Hufflepuffs enjoy a good mystery. Glad to hear you are up to the challenge. A plus, I believe. My great niece, Helen Thistlewood, can provide you with details. She's retired now, but. And the unsolved murder of which I speak. I often visit my portrait in her home, in the nearby hamlet of Upper Hogsfield. Shall I tell her to expect you? I shall go and see her right away. Brilliant. With what I suspected. I shall see you there. Soon, I hope. Let's see if we can just maybe teleport there. We... Whoa! Okay, yeah, we should try and teleport you then. <laughs> Save some time. Let's meet here I come. It's night. I'm gonna equip some gear on, fellas. Since we did get some handwear. Look at that. Look at that. That's what I'm talking about. That actually looks pretty sick, I'm not gonna lie. That kind of looks pretty sick. I'll equip that. And we can't use our, our own one, so that's whatever. Let's, I'm gonna go sell this real quick, gentlemen, and then, uh. Ready for a little change in fashion, are we? Plenty to choose from here, so take your time. I know some of that was a little bit of a zero, but... Be sure to stop by whenever you're about. Should I go sneaky or should I just try and like just murk everybody? 
I'm going to visit Helen Thistlewood right now. These rocks have seen better days. This must be the place Minister Diggory mentioned. Ah, here you are. I'm pleased to see you took my advice. Madam Thistlewood, I met your great uncle in his portrait in my common room. He sent me to speak to you. I'm pleased you came. Uncle Eldritch believes the book you found and its missing pages may be relevant to an unsolved case from my time as an aura. Very well. I'm listening. Decades ago, a student named Richard Jackdaw disappeared after going to meet a girl named Anne. They never found his body. When his headless ghost appeared briefly in Hogsmeade, wholly unaware of how he died, Anne was convicted of his murder and sent to Azkaban. It was in large part due to the testimony of a girl called Apollonia Black. Jealous of Anne, I think. That sounds so, terrible. Why don't we just say I'm Apollonia not sure Black? How I can help. Anne's alibi was somewhat labyrinth. She said Jackdaw promised her adventure following a map he found on some pages he'd stolen from Peeves. And you think Peeves ripped those pages from the book I found in the restricted section? If my great uncle is to be believed, yes. At least that's what the portraits at Hogwarts suspect. Anne insisted that Jackdaw had asked her to follow the map with him, but only after she solved a series of puzzles he'd prepared. Odd way to woo a girl. She swears she never even solved the first puzzle, so they didn't meet. Jackdaw's ghost vanished almost as soon as he appeared. Without Jackdaw's puzzle, pages, or remains, Anne was sent to Azkaban based solely on Apollonia's spurious testimony. I don't understand. What can I do to help? I believe Anne may have solved the first puzzle by now. But after spending time in Azkaban, she's a shadow of her former oh, self. Oh, so this, this is the she Azkaban quest I'm on? She doesn't trust. And she trusts okay. no one. If you, a student with a connection to the pages, like Jackdaw had, spoke to Anne, she might reveal new information. What a horrible story. If you think I can help, I'll come with you. This is wonderful news. You are to be commended for your kindness and bravery. Fortunately, being a retired Aura has its benefits. We can apparate right to her. I've escorted ministers, professors, and many others to that blasted place. Never a student, I'll admit, but I will keep you safe. So is the... Very well. The chick with the Let's go. Steady yourself. We'll apparate together. Don't worry. I've never splinched anyone. What the hell is splinching Do me? Don't splinch me. Don't splinch me. Don't splinch me. We'll be there in but a moment. Oh, okay. That's what she means. Okay. Oh, my dude's totally sick. Oh. Uh, Oh shit! Dementors! Yeah, Loki, that would have a pretty cool that spell to have, even if, like, you didn't the, have to deal with any of these guys, of really. It would pretty cool. Costs. Thank you for the warning. This really is a dismal place, but we'll be out of here soon enough. Now follow me. Mind your step. I never thought I'd see the inside of Azkaban for myself. 
Nasty Dementors. Not even I could convince the Ministry to send them off. There's no need for such monsters. Careful around, Dan. She's been here a lot longer than the rest of us. If I had my watch, I'd cast Crucio on the lot of you! You don't scare me, young cur. I teach you some little of what you should know of. That witch you're with has a dark cloud over her. I can feel it. Has someone come to feed me? Is, is someone there? No one at school's going to believe this. Now remember, Anne has been here a long time. The Dementors aren't kind. Have patience and speak She's bald. To quietly and respectfully. Ah, G.I. Jane Duke. Can't wait to see it. Who's there? Who speaks to me? Is that death finally come for me? I'm a student from Hogwarts. I found the book that you said would exonerate you. Ah, the book, the book. No one would look. None of the mages found the pages. Yeah, Jane, too. Can't Methinks wait to see it, Anne. the feckless knave meandered to his Baldy. cave. My fate was surely sealed in Upper Hockey Field. What are you trying to say? That the missing pages are in a cave near Upper Hogsfield? Hogs, hogs, fields, fields, ruins, house, a vault concealed. A vault in some ruins near Upper Hogsfield. I suppose it can't hurt to look. Can't hurt to look, can't hurt to look. Go find the pages from your book. Helen, Helen, now you're here. Come in closer, be a dear. What is it, Anne? Oh, shit. Oh, oh, what the? Oh my god, what the? Oh my god, she's so ugly. What the? What happened? What, what'd she, what'd she do? She like scratched her or something. What'd she stab her with? You hurt. Go. The cave. You're safe now. You have what you need. I'll be all right once I get. <laughs> but Madam Thistlewood, I. All right. I'll find it. Man, if I had a broom, I'd be cave. there and back in no time. I don't need a feat, that means I got an invisibility spell for a This reason. must be the place Anne told me about. No one's been here for ages. Oh, found the puzzle. Oh, what the fuck? Hey, it's a Merlin's puzzle. Don't I, do I have to, like, drop a... I can't, I can't get through, what the fuck? What do I gotta do? Accio. It's no wonder I never found that clue. What? There's literally no instructions. How am I supposed to figure out? No, that's not. Oh, okay. I get it now. No. I get it. How did you do this, Jack? You'll not outfox me, Jackdaw. Accio! It's no wonder I never found that clue. You couldn't outwit me, Jackdaw. Now, where's the clue you left behind? I 
note from Jackdaw. Anne never found it. So how did he die? Was she to blame at all? I'm totally gonna get jumped when I come out of this cave for sure. Calm on it. Could it be? Has someone solved my puzzle after all these years? Well done indeed. Hey, you were the dude Richard playing guitar. Jackdaw, at your service. The Richard Jackdaw. I heard you disappeared years ago. You have some ex I do. A retired aura, Helen Thistlewood, told me about a map you stole from Peeves. And then Anne told me about a cave. You saw Anne. Broke my heart. I had to go on without her. Probably best for her in the end. Dare I ask? How is she? She was imprisoned in Azkaban for your murder. Why didn't you exonerate her? What? Azkaban? Oh, poor... I've been traveling. I must speak to the aura you mentioned. I'm glad to hear it. I'm almost so... Uh, chill with this, dude. Thank, Thank you. you. I just... need to find... I shall... Cool beans, man. Uh, where do I go next? Who lived here, I wonder? Let's see what we're looking at right now. Oh. Well, guys, that is going to do it for episode four. I almost walked off a cliff accident. Hope you guys did enjoy, and uh, see you in the next one. Peace.